Show them that you're a tiger. Show them what you can do. The taste of Tony's Frosted Flakes brings out the tiger in you. They're great. And that's the fucking whole point I'm trying to get here, man. Be a fucking tiger. Be a cock of gold, guys. Fight the insecurities. You know what I'm saying? Being a cock of gold doesn't just mean being a professional pussy pounding champion. It also relates to the fact of your lifestyle. And trust me, I'm going to tell you from fucking experience, man. I'm telling you from things I've done in my past. Who gives a fuck what other people think, man? It's better to be a follower of yourself than a fucking follower of a fucking huge marching band. You know what I'm saying? Be a leader of yourself. It doesn't matter if you're the only guy leading that fucking band down the street with your little trumpet by yourself, throwing that stick in the high and doing 360 twirls and shit like a homosexual acrobat. It doesn't even matter. It's better to do that than fucking be following a bunch of morons just because you're scared of fucking standing up for what you want to do and afraid of people making fun of you. Fuck them, man. Who cares, dude? Just do what you gotta do and be that fucking person. For example, I'm using this fucking overpowered piece of shit M26 dart that I know the Battlefield 3 guys are gonna hate on me for because it's an overpowered fucking totally cheap gun to use. But I don't give a fuck. You know why? Because I suck at this game, man. I mean, I'm not totally horrible, but I gotta use any means possible to get a good fucking game. And this game is pretty good. It's quick and that's why I used it and I plant the MCOM and fucking defend the MCOM and play the objective using a cheap, basically for guys who play Call of Duty only. This shotgun I'm using right now is kind of the equivalent of the Modern Warfare 2 pre-patch 1867 Akimbo motherfucking double-barreled motherfucking shotguns of death. Look at this shit. Watch this. Boom. Boom. Yeah, you get fucked up too. This guy run over here. Hey, I heard there was a party over here and I heard we were handing out free punch. What's going on? Hey, hey, hey. Fuck you, die. And that's my point, guys. Insecurities, man. Kick that shit right out the window, dudes. I'm being straight up honest with you, dudes. It isn't worth it caring what other people think. As long as you're not hurting anybody, even if it's your fucking teacher, your parents, your fucking priest, your pastor, whatever it be, telling you to do one thing, if it's not hurting anybody, fuck them, man. I mean, like, their interests are probably for your best, but at the end of the day, you gotta fucking weigh the options here and think about, you know, what, what's gonna make me happy? Because really, at the end of the day, it's your life, and you only get one of them. And they catch me riding dirty, try to catch me riding dirty, I'm rolling, they hating. And that's the fucking point, guys. I mean, really, you got one life. And don't give a fuck what anyone else thinks. If you want to sit in your basement and pretend to be a fucking airline pilot smoking dope all day playing video games, if that's really going to make you fucking happy, and that's really what you want to do deep down inside and not suffering from a mental illness that tells you that you want to do that, then fucking do it, man. If you're upset about the way things are going in your life and you're not happy, fucking change it. Have the fucking courage and the fucking self-esteem and a lack of insecurities thinking you're going to fail. Fuck it. You know what? Michael Jordan said it best. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. So don't be afraid to take that fucking leap, man, and head out there and do something because you're afraid you're going to fail. If you don't do it, motherfucker, you've already failed, man. Trying to get all Tim Robbins, Tony Robbins here with a giant fucking head doing some kind of, I don't know, infomercial here on trying to sell you fucking motivational tapes, it sounds like. But I just want to fucking get out there because I get a ton of questions, man, and it all pertains to insecurities and it's basically afraid to be who you want to be. And that's all the point I want to reiterate here in this fucking commentary as I get in this helicopter here with a silky segue motherfucking edit and the guy flying this thing is a retarded idiot I mean remedial number one fucking player of the year look at this shit Ooh, doo, doo, doo. I'm thinking yeah I'm in a helicopter we're gonna do awesome oh shit no we're not could dunk into the ocean and we fucking blow up and I'm thinking thanks a lot you asshole you can see my mic heating up there and that's all I'm gonna leave it with you guys here be a cock and go in your own world fuck what other people think do what you want to do and stop caring what anyone else fucking thinks about you or are gonna judge you because at the end of the day their opinion doesn't mean a goddamn fucking thing if it makes you unhappy trying to pretend to be somebody you're not the cock of gold the balls of beauty and the anus of awesomeness rocking out with my frosted flakes 20 motherfucking tiger motivational speaker championship commentator of YouTube